Well, hello there, ladies and gentlemen. You're back with Tech Deck, and today we're playing some more Another Brick in the Mall. So, last episode, we've actually started taking a substantial profit now that we've got another one of these roads opened. But that's where we need to be careful, because now we're going to start getting bigger and bigger queues, and we need to be able to keep in front of that. I'm certain that we're going to need another store clerk or stock clerk, whatever they're called. We can barely keep up with that demand. Um, we need a trash can up there as well. What's that? Customers are leaving studies store without buying anything because some of the products are out of stock. Well, that answers my question, doesn't it? Um, give me... Anybody with good speed and crap sociability. Get you in for the 8 o'clock shift and give me another one as well. Um, you are naff. You're not bad. You're 70 years old. What the Christ? You are decent at your job though. And they do get better. I don't think they really need patience and it's screw it, there you go. So Schiffo's burger joint had a queue of one. Studley's store does kinda need more. Well, it needs more tills with the looks of it. Not only does it need more staff, it needs more tills. I'm thinking one more member of staff on the eight till sixteen shift. Um, there we go. Staff, let's hire a cashier. Oh, look at that dude. It looks like he's got a golden crown on. 8 to 16. Something has bodged up there. Cashiers, starting times. A manager, staff, is it? Oh, it didn't select the right person, that's why. <clears throat> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. You know what? Let's get some more checkouts so they can actually jump on and overlap. Holy Christ, this is getting ridiculous. Twelve, the takings just keep going up and up now. You know what? Schiffo's burger joint deserves a bit of an upgrade. Admittedly, it's not, um, it's not taking as much cash as I'd like it to. And it's not as busy as I'd like it to be, but it still needs to uh, it still needs to grow a little bit. So let's go like that. Let's move this door out to there. I could make uh, expand the toilet out a bit more, but why? Assign fast food restaurant, and you're gonna expand out to there. Um, can we remove that wall, please? We kind of need more um, more trash cans as well. Now, I can't get these in here realistically. Well, I could get a couple of them. Just with where all the, uh, the things are. This is why I wanted this store to be longer. But for now, I'm just going to expand it downwards. Let's just stick to food court tables. There we go. What did we end up taking yesterday? 11,000. It seemed like it was going up more than that, but not really going to complain too much. Right. We've had no Q note for K. Damn it. If my staff had been there a couple of seconds earlier, 
I don't think we would have had a problem there. I'm not going to get another cashier for like two customers not being served. It's not even midday and we're already two grand into profits. That's ridiculous. Two customers left unsatisfied. I don't know. The extra store clerks that we got seem to be having a brilliant effect. How is Dax Knickknacks doing? Honestly, we've not been here in a while. Still taking about five grand a day. Wonderful. Studley's shop just keeps climbing. Just keeps climbing. Yeah, they seem to be on top of things now. Right, how about... Hello. For one person leaving. To be fair, I think we need to get in front of the curve here and get another member of staff hired. A8. And yeah, we need another one on the 16 o'clock shift. Are you there? Check out that noise. Right, it's done this again to me. It's screwed me around. 0, 16, 8, 16, 16. Now, that's what I want. I want two cashiers on each shift. I thought that once you hired a cashier, it took you out onto the cashier you just bought. Hired, even. Damn it. Um, but it doesn't seem to do that. You know what? Let's also get this sorted. Foundations. So if I do that, and that, and that. Move that. Move that. And remove walls. Get all of that chopped out, all of that, and all of that chopped out. I will remember to assign these stores in a second. If I can get on top of this now, then we can get the actual look of the high street starting. We've got queues at 2 o'clock in the morning. Really? It's for one person. I think they need another cashier, don't they? Starting hours. One, two. Yeah, I've only got two. Hire another cashier, screw it. We've got Josh, what's his face? You right there. Yeah, that's fine. That brings it up to three. Again, can't fix this problem today. It'll be fixed tomorrow. I think it's good, actually, us doing it this way around. Waiting, for, look at all the opportunities we're missing now. That is somewhat upsetting. Um, we should wait until we get the notification to whether we get any more staff. Um, people are wanting restaurants. But none of you come and visit my goddamn dining... Hello. Restaurants is going to keep popping up. I've got staff missing from there, I swear to God. Um, they're leaving a Yumi store. They're leaving Oak's Barrel. Oh, Oak's Barrel. Why is it so busy? Oh, there's a pandemic. Everybody's panic buying. Right, I'm, I'm not going to pay any attention to this. They're literally buying out all of my drugs and everything. I'm not getting another cashier just because of a viral outbreak. That's daft. Admittedly, it does mean 7% won't come back tomorrow. That's kind of crap. Studley store. Aqua store. Oh yeah, they're wanting a drugstore as well. Again, it's a viral outbreak. They've all got their bloody masks on. Oh. They're buying toilet rolls. Hmm. I guess coronavirus has kicked in then. And everybody's buying their lovely toilet rolls that they're going to live off. Stupid. Yeah, we had that in our shop as well when uh, COVID kicked in. Everybody buying bloody toilet rolls. It doesn't come out of that end. Not with COVID. What do I sell? You are a grocery store, Studley. You sell lots and lots of foods. And let's move all of these up as well. I think we need to get some trash cans around as well. There we go. 
Wait, I don't need to assign these again, do I? No, I just need to assign store and store and storage. Get rid of all them. These are still set up, right? Yeah, they're still set up. Um, remove foundation from there. You're going to get me to build a wall all the way across this now, aren't you? Just remember, um, it's loads easy. There we go. Wait, don't do that. That's it. It's actually starting to look a little bit like High Street. We will get round to building this um, jewellery store at one point today. How did we lose money yesterday? Probably from the queues. And that's going to have a knock-on effect of today. Because, obviously, people are going to be a little bit peed off that um, I couldn't serve them all. Well, Soz, right. It was a viral outbreak. What do you want me to do? Can you put flowers and stuff down in this game? You can, can't you? Just a thought. Oh god, Christmas is coming up. We've not got a toy store or anything. Is jewellery in... Why is jewellery not in the Christmas season? You'd have thought jewellery would have been in the Christmas season. <clears throat> well, anyway. Um, I can't remember these dimensions. Um, helps if you're building a foundation, not removing it. 12. Why can I never remember 12? There we go. And I know these shops are all looking very samey. I don't apologise though. One way swing gate. Now that's an idea. <clears throat> Make it so they've got to come in this door and out this door. Oh, I'm not doing anything fancy like that yet. I want to get my high street with all my little individual personalised stores going first. You know, I don't know if we've got any theft or not. It's not told me. Uh, what was I doing? Doors. Let's have a staff door there. Something doesn't quite look right about them check out queues, but... I guess really I should have three tools in each one that cover the middle three aisles each. It'll be fine. Um, can we get a double door? Right there. Yeah, my brain melted a little bit there. Shut up. <clears throat> And give me tables, wasn't it? Yes. It's just going to go like that. And checkouts. Again, I tried to press the wrong bloody button. Yeah, it does look dead weird that they stagger up and down, but whatever. Uh, no queues again for a while, which isn't bad. How's the takings doing? Seven and a half again. It's still not bad. Um, let's assign this a store. And we need to rename this because it's going to be Stephen and just for the storage. It's going to be Stephen and Sky Storage, and we've got Sky Fury. You've got a jewelry store. I need a name. Whoop. There. 
staff, hire cashier. I would like you. Mm, I would like you. I would like you. And a stock clerk, please. Sky shiny ball balls. <laughs> really? Shiny ball balls for all year round. Well, I can't argue. That's the name. Skies. I had to look at my keyboard then. I can't spell ball balls. The, the word just confuses me. Um, assign that one. Misc. All. Jewelry. That is a jewelry store. Brilliant. And let's build this. And let's get more floor tiles further down like that. And let's get more road built up. We've still got loads of time. Just had to have a glance across there. Let's bring that further out there. Let's bring this further out here. Let's get some more staff parking. Maybe in a second. Um, maybe I should get some actual customer parking down this way so they've not got to walk from all the way across there. Not loads. I want to remove that bit of road there as well. Again, we've had no queues popping up, which is dead nice. Build that one. And customer parking. Right, now that we've got four shops there, I think we should call that like a set and just split it up a bit. And have a road coming through the middle. And maybe a road coming down. Well, I don't know where the road coming down would go, but if I just put that there to remind myself. Yeah, a nice block of four. Actually, I bet I could get that road closer there, couldn't I, when I go for my redesign. That notification of me playing RimWorld. Thanks, Steam. Oh, what, you can see that there? That's meant to be turned off. You're not meant to be able to see notifications pop up. <laughs> yeah, just, just a little bit of parking this way. I know I've already got an obscene amount of parking. I'm sorry. Um, sorry. What? So they're after clothes shops, they're after butcher shops, coffee shops. I do think we need to get more into the restaurants and the coffee shops and stuff like that. And actually, this could be a nice little maintenance centre over here. Which then I could get rid of this one in here and have this as a bigger storage. I like the idea of that. We don't want every shop having its own maintenance centres. That's just daft. There's no reason for the doors on the back here. Staff can get round the back themselves. Um, let's get some more staff-only parking. In fact, this is somewhat dim-witted. Take that up. I'm going to have a bus stop on this corner. I don't know how long it's going to be before I start ripping these shops to pieces. This one, I think, is going to stay there for quite a while. Well, actually, they're all going to stay there for quite a while because they're all earning cash. Oh! We've got some queues in Studley's store. Shifo's burger joint's actually getting queues? You serious? It is getting more busy, so how about we get... Two more cashiers. One for the 8 o'clock shift. And you've got no sociability. What the Christ. Zoe for the 16 o'clock shift. This is just preempting it getting a little bit busier. <clears throat> I know I keep saying that I'm not going to do that, but Studley's store, we, we can kind of grin and bear that. It'd actually be nice if we could get Studley's store to, like, take over all of this bit and make it into a huge, like, superstore. 
Although really, there's nothing else it can sell. This is this should be as big as it gets, unless I like move Oak's barrel somewhere. Actually, I could repeat this this side, have one more block of parking in the middle, <clears throat> and then have stores like say this side. Um, let's get this bus stop built in right there. Shifo's burger joint had a queue of two, and I've hired two brand new cashiers for that. Brilliant. I like the idea of that road. So this is going to come down here one more. We're going to remove that bit of road. Screw it. Get rid of that as well. And that. Staff parking. Do away with it. <clears throat> we do not need it. It's a weird looking high street if you've got parking in the middle of the road, right? We've got queues. It's two people. And it was like at 7.02, an hour before we get more people in. I get, I'm not employing somebody else for that. Akash seems to be staying up though. Ooh, 15 grand, baby. Um, where is my mask gun? Restrooms. Yeah, this is why we need to get something a bit more <clears throat> centralised. Wait, what? Go right there. Ah, that's better. So yeah, they're going to have to walk straight across the road to get into these shops, but they'll be fine. They'll be fine. We need some trash cans in these shops as well. Where are we? Trash can, right there, right there, right there. Just so we've got one in each shop. Just a little bit. Now I've got the bus stop there. Um, Roadworks, let's get some more customer parking right there. Yeah, I like that. And let's get this um, foundation built up like that. This is a huge maintenance centre. We absolutely do not need it to be this large, but screw it. It is going to be taking this maintenance centre. What have we got in here? We've got three janitors. Yeah, I'm literally just going to throw them into this maintenance centre that we're making now. Then expand this back into all one um, food storage. Let's actually also Remove that. Excuse me. Because then we want to get a pavement two tiles wide across here. Like so. And that's where our high street looks going to come in. Really, we've got queues again. It's going to be studlies. Holy Christ, that... All right, then you can have a cash here. Okie okay, okay. hire cashier, who have we got? You'd be good as a janitor or something, but... You're kind of crap all the way around. You'll do Brendan Green. Yeah, you can come in at midnight. That'll do. That'll do. I, I do think we need more builders again now. Um, let's go here, staff, transfer all these to... Nope, because I've not set it up yet. Ha! Huh. Ha! Huh. That one. Maintenance centre. I'm going to stop naming these, I think. Whoops, I did not mean to do that. Let's call this one multi-maintenance. Multi-maintenance. Staff. Transfer all staff. Go to multi-maintenance. Yes, please. Um, assign. Let's get this all to be storage. Proceed. Build. Let's remove this wall. There we go. Again, there's absolutely no reason for there to be two different doors there, but... 
Um, where are all the builders at? Transfer to... Excuse me. Staff, builder. Okay. You can transfer them as different jobs. Uh, transfer, multi-maintenance builder. Are they all gone? So our builders are a bit more centralised now. Holy Christ, we've got more queues in Studley store again. It just gets busier and busier. Yeah, you thought me complaining about things going badly was bad. Wait till you see me complain. Oh, hey, 200 customers. Wait till you see me complaining about um, there being too many customers. It's just going to keep getting busier. Let's get another member of staff for the 8 o'clock. And I'd say we need another one for the 16 o'clock. Mm. There's nobody here that's decent. Let's leave it another day. Most of my checkouts are full at this point. And imagine this is only one road that we've got. Imagine what happens when you've got the other two added on as well. It gets absolutely absurdly busy. But I guess that's where you need the bigger shops because you want more quantity out there for them to just come and buy that rather than clearing out your shelves straight away. It is looking like we might need another stock clerk. The money's just piling in now. That is ridiculous. What was that one? Daily profit. What did we just take? 21,000. Um, have I got any new staff now? I'll take you. You're not brilliant like, but I'm coming for the 8 o'clock shift. Um, ma -ma -ma -ma, you're dreadful. You're not bad. You're coming for the 16 o'clock shift. Studley's um, stores up to 9 staff in. On the on Just on the tills, that is. Um, right, builders, staff, hire a builder. You'd be good for that one. You need to be zero, you need to be a, you need to be zero, you need to be 16. Um, I can hire you for eight o'clock and another builder for 16 o'clock. These staff are actually getting terrible. I'll take ye. Yeah, I'll take you. There we are. A few more builders. Maybe some more of this work will get done a bit quicker now. And I think if we're taking 20 grand a day, we should just be able to fork it out. Yeah, this shop needs to move from being over there. I I'm liking the high street idea we're getting going now. So, we are basically at time. It's going to be a touch shorter. Hello. Out of stock. Oh. Staff, you have only got one stock clerk at the minute. Two, three, four, five. Give me another stock clerk. Tina Pitts. Haven't we got somebody else that's teen at something Pitts? I'm going to hire you, and you can come in for the 16 o'clock shift. There we go. That should help out. We're out of stock. Oh no, how dare we. This is where we're going to have to start building a bigger liquor store. These little shops in the middle are good for now, but they're not going to be good. Are you actually taking cash? Oh my god. Sky's shiny baubles is taking five grand a day. And it's got one cashier. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, the Christ. You know what? I could actually move these um, these bins outside of the shops now. I don't think we necessarily need them inside the shops, being as though we've got an actual pavement. Everybody wants my baubles. Damn right they do, Sky. Everybody wants them baubles. That is ridiculous, the amount of cash we take now. Well, we've had no more complaints from Studley store. I'm almost tempted to start ripping this up now. Um, you know what? We've got Christmas coming in one day, 22 hours. Let's um, let's pause the game there. We'll end the episode off. And what we're going to do is we're going to get a simple toy store down here. Because I think what we'll be able to do, we'll be able to have one shelf of each of the different... To what do we need for a toy store? Demand. Toys and games. So really, 50% of it can be these quite easily, actually. We'd get 60% of it if we had all three of these. And then we could get, like, greeting cards. And then, like, just the, um, the school, the footballs. I think we sell footballs over here. Sports balls. Yeah, I could just put those in the um, in the shop over this way. But we'll go with the same design we've got here. It's a shame you can't copy-paste, honestly. That'd be a cool feature. Because I basically want to build this exact same thing over this side and then get four more shops. Say a toy store, maybe a computer store, a phone store, and something else. Maybe, kind of, sort of. Anyway, you'll have to find out how we do in tomorrow's episode. So, thank you very much for watching. If you've enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe if you'd like to see some more. All comments and feedback greatly appreciated, as always. And in the description below is a few links if you'd like to go take a look. Most important one, be in the community Discord, where you can come and watch these episodes live as they're being recorded. Come have a look. Anyway, I'll see you guys next time. Cheers.